Today's show is all about survival after 35. And now I'm introducing you to a man. He's a nutritionist and trainer who's unlocked the signs to completely reshaping your body. And he figured it out by closely studying all the women in his life. Then guess what? He went on to help thousands of women like these. Shauna lost 89 pounds and 32% body fat. What a difference. Monique lost 60 pounds and 19% body fat. She lost all the fat. And Claudette, she lost 29 pounds and 18% body fat. Please meet Mark McDonald. I'm here to tell you your yo-yo dieting days are over. Mark McDonald. He's the mastermind behind the latest weight loss phenomenon that's transforming thousands of women. Come on, finish strong. And he says he has the secret to transform your over 35 body for good. I've been there. I was an athlete growing up. But then once I stopped playing sports, I ate pizza every day with ice cream, I gained 60 pounds in six months. I was determined to get my six pack abs back at any cost. I tried all the diets and I got great results. I was starving and miserable. Growing up, I saw my mom struggle with dieting. I saw it happen with my wife. I was determined to crack the code for pain-free, permanent weight loss. Now, McDonald is the driving force behind thousands of success stories. Even Chelsea Handler credits Mark for reshaping her body. I finally uncovered the secret to turn your body into a calorie-burning machine. And you don't need a fancy gym or a magic pill. And the best part? is you're never going to feel hungry again. Welcome to the show, Mark. Thanks, now, now, Mark argues that the way you turn your body into a calorie-burning yeah. machine has to do with blood sugar and how you balance it. So yeah. please explain. So when your blood sugar is balanced, your hormones are balanced, and that triggers your body to consistently release stored fat, and that's how we achieve permanent weight loss. All right, so it's not about eating less or starving yourself. And let me explain how this works. Yep. Come on over, Mark. We'll do this together. So we have created three different versions of how you eat your food. Right, and this is the sugar that we eat in our body. You can manage yep. that. Okay. This is what your body looks like. So when you're young, you kind of want it to look like this. And as you pour the, the food in there, if you eat too much sugar, guess what happens? <laughs> you get bigger and bigger. Pour it all in there. Pour it all in there. And, and you <laughs> put on a lot of weight. And you're not happy about that. So you get mad at yourself. So guess what you do? You eat some more. Yeah. And you get even bigger. Right? <laughs> yeah, why do you think women beat themselves up so much and don't come back from this? You know, it's a, to me, it's the mindset that we're so focused right now on calorie restriction, carbohydrate restriction. We think to lose weight, we have to starve ourselves, and it, it's so painful. So what ends up happening, we follow that yo-yo dieting syndrome, and it's, a, it's just a better way. If you understand how to eat the food you love and about eating more, not less, you really can stabilize your blood sugar. Well, you just mentioned it. Take us through the scenario of somebody who yeah. starves themselves, because this is what often happens. Yeah. So you've done this. We hit our tipping point. Right. We cut our calories. We cut our carbs. We think, let's just get the weight off as fast as possible. And what happens? This drives you crazy. You get just as big. Yeah. Just as big. Because when you don't have any sugar in your body, your body thinks, very justifiably, yeah. you're in starvation mode. If you're in starvation mode, you're going to hold on to anything that comes in your body, as, and you're going to store those fat cells. What? Instead, you burn down muscle. So the, what you lose in that yo-yo process... Yeah is muscle mass, which means that you, as soon as you begin eating a little bit more again, because every once in a while you're going to go off this diet, yeah. back to old-fashioned, guess what happens? You get a yeah. Which is why it's even worse for you, because you don't have any muscle burning through calories. So what if you eat the amount of food, in particular sugars, between starving yourself and what you did in the very first scenario, which is to get heavy? Go ahead and pour that you in there. You get the body you want, and you achieve permanent weight loss. Yep. And you're where you want to be? Body Look confidence. Body Looking confidence. Looking and feeling your very best. Yeah. Makes sense? The critically important insight that Mark has. All right, let's go through the plan. Okay. It's all about stabilizing your blood sugar in order okay. to lose weight and to keep it off for life. So step yeah. number one, you argue, is to eat equal portions, eat in threes. 